Hi guys, welcome to Jeffy's Adventures. I am right now in Mount Hood National Forest, which is east of Portland, about about an hour and 20 minute drive east from where I live. And uh, yeah, so uh, I came back from my other episode of Coffee Time today. It's been a couple weeks since the last episode. And it's really been a lot of fun planning for my next adventure, which is coming up. And I'll share that with you in just a second. But right now, let me give you the intro. See you in a minute. Yeah, welcome back. Look at this beautiful place I'm in. It's just so gorgeous. The trees are huge. The, oh, the sound of the river and just the pure beauty. You got ferns and moss all over the trees. It's just amazing to me. The pure beauty. Look at, see the river down there? Wow, it's just gorgeous. And these trails are just so full of nature. It's so beautiful here. Look, how cool is that, huh? Yeah. So I like to spend my time when I'm not cruising as much as I can in the wilderness. It's, it's just my place, you know? I mean, look at the beauty I'm in right now. It's just so cool. I mean, how could you not wanna be here, right? I mean, sure, there's bugs, but who cares? <laughs> anyway, I wanted to share with you guys my next adventure that's coming up in just a few weeks from now. By the time you guys see this, it'll actually just be a couple weeks away. And those episodes will be starting again. And we're flying down to Los Angeles to uh, Long Beach. And we're going to get on the Carnival Radiance first. And that is all about food. Oh my gosh, they have the new menu on that ship with uh, the, ins it's been inspired by Emeril Lagasse. And of course, I will be at every MDR meal to show you guys that experience. I can't wait, that's gonna be so cool. Whew, new food on Carnival, how cool. And then, right after that, I am going to go on the Panorama, which is literally the very next day. And that is my Diamond Cruise on Carnival. And that's going to be super cool. I can't wait to share that with you guys. Um, man, 200 days at sea with Carnival. All right, so we got two cruises coming up here in about two weeks and we are jumping again aboard the Carnival Radiance. We're gonna to go to Catalina Island and to um, Ensenada. And in Ensenada, right now we have planned, tentatively planned to do a wine tour, which is cool. And I've done it before, but I've, I, I wish I could say I vlogged it <laughs> because um, this is gonna be kind of neat. In, in that area, a major contender when it comes to making wine, they've dumped a lot of money into it. I, I did it about two years before the pandemic, so that's the last time I was there, but a lot of new wineries have opened since then. So I will be bringing that to you guys. Uh, let's see. And then in Catalina Island, I'm going to just go around town and show you what to do. Uh, this time, I'm just going to give you guys a sites where to go, where to eat. Um, there's a few restaurants I've dined at. The restaurant that I love to go to, unfortunately, is always closed on the day we get there. I don't know if they do that on, intentionally for the cruise line. I don't know. But it's got the best chowder. But I'll show you guys. It's really cool. Um, the, the restaurants to go to. And let's see what else is there. Um, and then all the uh, cookies and all the ice creameries are just outstanding. So I'll show you all that as well. Uh, let's see. Now on the Carnival Panorama. Um, I'm looking forward to that because 
the panorama is my my heart's in that that ship it just is one of my favorite ships of carnival's fleet it's one of their newest ships not the newest but it is absolutely one of my favorite ships in size um, you know I went on the Mardi Gras I felt that that ship was really big for me I didn't like uh, the layout as much as I do the panorama so I'm really excited to get back on the panorama and share that experience with you all Woo. all right it's time for a commercial tell me what you guys got I, I've always wanted to know what you guys see when you get a commercial yeah that's kind of neat huh all right tell me what you get I'll be right back yeah, so yesterday's weather was overcast and we went up to Mount Hood. I'll show this right here. I, I flew the drone over the lake. Mount Hood is a, a dormant volcano uh, that has uh, beautiful sights. It's, it's just gorgeous to live nearby. And uh, so this is what that looks like. I'll insert that footage here. back guys oh my gosh I can't wait to share my experience with you guys on the radiance and on the panorama it's gonna be so much fun it's just I can't get over it I'm I haven't been on a ship for about almost two months now and that's a very long time for me as you all know and uh, yeah we just got off the MSC Maravilla out of New York City and I, I just can't wait to get back on the ship. I do have some more trips planned. I haven't announced them yet. Uh, although, on my webpage, PoolersTravel.com, you can catch up on all the activities that are available um, and all the upcoming cruises. The schedule will be posted in mid-September uh, for everybody to be able to follow uh, Jeffrey's adventures at all times and what cruise ships I'm booked on. And if you want to join, you know, you're welcome to come. Uh, I do not do group cruises. I would uh, rather just have somebody uh, join uh, a cruise ship that we're on and you can hang out and absolutely we'll have dinner, whatever, at the same dinner time. Uh, yeah, so that's a little bit more personal to, to me. I think that's better. Um, having a, a group is it's a lot of work and it's not that I don't want to work. I also have to vlog and, and share content with you guys. And that's why I do this is uh, share my experiences with you guys on cruise ships. So. I, I'm looking forward to this next series. It's going to be two series and the first one is obviously the Carnival Radiance and all the food that I, I mentioned earlier. And then the next episodes will be the Carnival Panorama, which is my Diamond Cruise and that'll be, I'll be celebrating my 200th day at sea with Carnival Cruise Lines. That's a huge, huge amount of cruising on just one cruise line. Now you guys know I go on other cruise lines on Royal Caribbean. Um, I'm, I, you know, I'm, gosh, I'm really up there there. I, th I think I'm at 120 plus days with them and I'm Princess uh, close to 100, not quite. I think I'm in the in the 80s and then um, now MSC <laughs> and then a, a lot of other cruise lines that were uh, when I was a kid so I don't want to uh, I won't bring those up <laughs> anyway um, so yeah I, I can't wait to share this experience with you especially after coming off of MSC and going back to Carnival after doing Princess and Royal um, I'm kind of excited to see what the food's going to be like, uh, especially with the uh, influence of Emerald Lagasse. Uh, that's, to me, that's going to be kind of cool to be able to get one, on one of the first ships that have it and to share that experience with you guys. Uh, I will dive into the food as I always do and give you my thoughts because I, I, I'm really hoping that it's a beautiful uh, 
uh, transformation because they need it. And I'm not saying that the food's bad. I'm just saying a change is needed and I think they're doing it the right way. So I'm excited for them and for me. <laughs> and I can't wait to share that with you guys. So, all right guys, I'm gonna go back to my camping and enjoy my day with my friends and my wife and have a great day here in the wilderness and kick back, relax, and enjoy this beautiful weather we're having. And I hope you enjoy. If you haven't done so, please consider subscribing. It's absolutely free. It helps my channel. And by the way, thank you all to have uh, that have subscribed lately. Uh, we just hit our 2000 mark uh, a week ago. Uh, that's a great um, feeling to just know that we're growing that fast. It's been a, a great experience for us. And uh, thank you for being a part of it. And uh, and if you like what you see, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up. I appreciate it very much. I can't wait to uh, share the next episode with you guys. We'll see you guys soon. Coffee time on the next ship. See you guys soon. Bye. <laughs>